Hi, this is Mike with survivalreviews.com. Today we're looking at the Cold Steel Big Bore Magnum 625 caliber blowgun. This happens to be the 50 inch model. I'm about six feet tall, you can tell how tall it is. It has a plastic molded mouthpiece area. Here's a close-up of the dark collection that I have. This is all of the products that Cold Steel provides. Uh, the long one up front is the bamboo dart. It's a good game hunting dart. Uh, of course, they're not very sturdy or reusable, to, but they will penetrate quite well through, through soft tissue. <clears throat> the one on the right here with the orange balls on the end, those are the standard stun darts. They're great for shooting cans and practicing with. Uh, they don't damage the surface. They can be re reused a lot of times. Cold Steel talks about drilling a hole in the tip of them and putting a like a, a screw in there to give it a little bit more weight and a little bit more oomph. If you want more oomph, they also sell this Magnum stun dart. You can see it's much much larger than the standard one. Uh, it, it comes out with a great deal more speed and packs a lot more punch. But again, it's not going to penetrate anything. It, it's just for target shooting. The broadhead dart here has a, a steel tip to it. It's uh, not sharp. It is not, this is called the broadhead dart. It's not razor edge or anything, but it does have a very sharp point. It will penetrate nicely. And then this is the standard broadhead dart with a stamped, the, the, the steel shaft is just stamped flat and they make a kind of a heart shape on it with a very fine tip point. Very good for hunting game. Okay, we'll do a little practice shooting. We'll try a standard broadhead dart. We'll try the stand the large broadhead dart. Here's the results of hitting a can with the spear point. You can see it went all the way through, formed a nice big fat hole in the back where the cone hit. The tip of the point went straight through the can. This point could definitely kill small game birds, frogs, fish, squirrels. Uh, be good for hunting when you need to eat. This is a, a good survival tool. This is the uh, broadhead mountain drop impact test. <laughs> oh. that's, a, that's a dead soda can. Okay, let's do the Pepsi Max. Spear point. This is a spear point coming out of a uh, cold steel magnum blowgun, what, 625 magnum? Here's the penetration results. The spear point made a very nice solid hole. The broad point tip really made its way through the can, all the way through a very strong puncture wound. You normally would not expect the ball to go in into the target, 
but through a flimsy aluminum can, it went through very strongly.